This is my medicine drawer. <laughs> Oi. Guys, it's so freaking cold in my house. Like, let's see, I don't know if you can see outside. Can you see outside? It's all wet and nasty. I don't know if you can really tell, but it's been raining and cold and gross. And it's just like, oh, it's cold. <laughs> my mom always said you could tell how I'm not feeling well or my lips are so pale. <laughs> She's like, you could always tell when you're when you're feeling really sick because my lips go white. <sighs> yeah, I just slept like over 12 hours. I don't understand. I went to bed at 10. Like I fell asleep around 10 o'clock so I could wake up like a normal person, you know? I slept from 10 o'clock to 3 p.m. 10 o'clock p.m to 3 o'clock p.m. the next day. What the heck? Hi, guys. Um, today is the 11th of June. And this entire month I've done nothing productive. <laughs> uh, I'm having a really, really bad health day today. It's mainly just fatigue. Like, my body just feels like it's full of lead. Like, my limbs feel like they're full of lead and I can't move them. And I'm just, like, it's all horrible. I don't know. Um, I feel bad because I haven't been vlogging. But literally, I haven't been doing anything but resting. My body has been so, so fatigued um which i mean can be a good thing because it could mean that the medication's working and my body's literally using every last ounce of energy it has to fight this disease that's in my in me <laughs> this horrible disease lyme disease literally sucks your life away Ugh. So, I slept 17 hours last night. <laughs> like, I know to some people that might sound absolutely ridiculous and be like, well, so not good for you, and you should, you know, you should have forced yourself awake earlier and not been lazy and blah blah blah. But can I tell you, it has nothing to do with being lazy, it has everything to do with the fact that my body is so weak, my immune system is so weak, that rest is the only way that I can deal with what's going on. Um, I went to bed early last night thinking, oh yay, I'm, I fell asleep around 10.30ish, you know, p.m. And I was like, okay, that means, you know, I get my 12 hours in and I can wake up and be good to go at, you know, 10 a.m. Which is still, I know, like, late for a lot of people, but for me, that'd be awesome. Because then, you know, stuff is still open when I'm awake. Um, but I didn't wake up till 2.30 p.m. Or 3 p.m. actually. Like, and I had to crawl out of bed because I was still so tired I could have gone back to sleep but I was just like I have to do some things today like I had to call some doctors and stuff and they closed at four so you know obviously I need to make myself get up and call them um golly I don't even understand what's going on with me like I haven't had this sort of fatigue since Geez, since before I had was diagnosed with Lyme's. So, like, in over 10 years, I haven't been this tired. 
I've been pushing myself, I think, probably a little bit too much. I've been trying to get the vlogs up, trying to get some videos done. And I just don't think my body could have quite handled that, or could handle that quite yet. So I still want to continue doing videos and stuff. I think I'm going to cut back as far as the editing goes. And I was trying to, like, catch up and get everything edited and posted. You know, I got, like, four videos edited, like, yesterday. But I don't think that I can handle that. But, uh, which, I mean, proof I can't handle that. Because my body needed 17 hours of rest. Like, it's just imagine that you have the flu. Like, the worst flu that you've had ever. And literally all you can do is sleep. Because your body is so weak from fighting it off that you just have to sleep. Well, that's basically what chronic fatigue syndrome is, or Lyme disease is, is your body is constantly fighting this thing. And, I mean, you don't have much energy to begin with, but then every ounce of energy you do have is being used to fight off 